I'm Debbie Peverell and you're listening to the weekly tip from Payless Financial Training Group. Today I'm talking about a court case that held that the thumbs up emoji was actually the same as legally signing a document. So a Saskatchewan court has held that a customer who ordered a product, whatever, and got a, re- a text back from the corporation saying thumbs up that they had to honor their commitment to provide the product. So it's interesting to me, um, having been around forever, used to be when if you wanted something to be legal, you had to sign it in person. Then fax signatures were accepted by courts. And of course, we've moved on to digital signatures being acceptable even to CRA. So the idea that an emoji, a thumbs up, a thumbs down, a happy face, who knows, could actually be legally binding was news to me. And I think it's something that we should be keeping in mind. If you're doing business by text message, and I know that I have clients that do, you shouldn't be thinking that that's a pretty casual thing. Because, as we've seen, the court has held that an emoji is legally binding. So I guess we should consider being a little more careful when you are replying to text messages because it's not you know it's going to be committing you to doing something just as though you had signed a signature with a witness so something to watch out for